Chinaman Mine is just up the hill. We've been looking around. We found this area. What I'm standing on is a bunch of loose gravel. Looks like it was placed here a long time ago because there's trees growing on it. All this loose gravel in this area certainly is evidence of something man-made. Unless I'm stupid and this is all just natural, but I don't think this is natural. Let me kind of take a look here. For all we know, this right here could have been the mine and all that's left of it. Oh. Very clean. <laughs> oh, something. Keep it cool. Oh. Uh, wow, someone else was drinking coffee. Coffee? <laughs> well, I'm making coffee. I'm making Who wants coffee? coffee? You want so coffee? So this is the coffee. renowned mine. It's a mound. <laughs> Maybe, I don't know. <laughs> There's a very interesting metal structure right here. What is it? I'm not sure what this is. Certainly fascinating. Ooh. Ah, this does look interesting. People have definitely been down here. Almost tripped. Well, onward. Height. goes pretty deep. What is all this? The yellow stuff. Yellow cake? No. <laughs> That's an actual thing. Of, is it really? Yeah. yeah, but it's not cake. It's for depleted uranium. <laughs> Look at all these stuff. What is what? it? What? It's uh, the beginning of a horror movie. <laughs> yeah, basically. This. That? I'm not pushing it. At least not with my No hand. idea what that is. I want to touch it. <laughs> yeah, don't do that. It looks soft. <laughs> it could be anything from something from a bug, an animal, or chemical. Who knows what this is? Don't touch it. Not with my hand. Don't touch the wooden beams. <laughs> just don't just leave it alone. Don't, touch the don't beams. leave it all alone. Don't touch anything. Don't, rocks. <laughs> don't touch anything. Don't mess with anything. Look out. Let me oh, get in front of you guys. Yeah. <laughs> this is really cool. Who's that? Did you just whisper? No. Who just whispered? I don't think anyone did. No, please tell me that someone just whispered. No, seriously, did you just whisper? I, d I said that. You're hearing yeah, things. Alright. Now we head out. We continue to explore the area and see what else is out there. The renowned mine sure is renowned. Rio Doso was settled by the Mescalero Apache many centuries ago. They believe that gods reside within the mountains that protect them. Rio Doso would be settled in the mid 19th century. The oldest building constructed within the village was built by Paul Dalwin in 1869 and is still standing to this very day. More people would move to Rio Doso throughout the 19th century.
Thanks to the rise of automobiles, a makeshift road would be constructed that would lead to Rio Doso. In 1914, the very first cabins would be built. Mining has been going on in the Rio Doso and Lincoln County Forest area for over a century, and mining operations still persist to this day. Between 1960 and 2015, there have been at least seven fatalities in abandoned mines throughout Rio Doso. In 2017, the U.S. Forest Service promised to close many of the abandoned mines. However, many of them are still open. Some locals believe that the ghosts of the miners that have died in these mountains still haunt the valleys and woods. Some also believe that the area is home to the mystical creature known as the Wendigo. According to legend, it hunts people at night, using the voices of their family members to lure them away from safety and eats them. Yeah. This is the Parsons mine. Fire, someone's camped out in here. Yeah. I still smell it too. I think it was homeless people. Look, this, the cans, the way that the cans are opened. This far out though? Yeah. I mean, we're kind of in the middle of nowhere. Whoa, that's cool. Whoa, Whoa. I want to climb that really bad. I don't. Can I do it? Can I climb it? I don't. I don't. The path diverges. Oh, no. Hey, what's this? This path looks like it ends. That, wait, that one ends? I don't know yet. This one's going. This is that's the worst thing you can do. It's all one way. Okay. Yeah, it ends right here. Okay, so it's still pretty cool. Yeah. Yo, this is so cool. Can we practically standing up. Well, now I can stand up. I still can't. <laughs> That is a cherry bomb. That was great. All ends. It ends right there? And it's will be here. One of them is still together. <laughs> People have been here and left graffiti. People have left here and left their seed. It's <laughs> fascinating. Just and like that, that is not family like that friendly. Line. This is a family Especially friendly channel. <laughs> Well, this one wasn't as big as the other one. Well, deep, I should say. But it's certainly imposing. Wow. Look out. Take a look in there. Can I see your light? Oh, yeah. There's a whole other tunnel back here. That's cool. But the hole, the hole is only big enough for me. <laughs> yeah. Honestly, I don't think you should risk it. After we had finished with the Parsons mine, we headed to our campsite. We sat around the fire, taking in the beauty of the mountains. At the break of dawn, we awoke to a cold and bitter wind. After cleaning up the campsite, we headed home. Rio Doso has a fascinating and rich history and is an important part of New Mexico. Although many of its abandoned mines lay open, they and these beautiful mountains 
that will never be in your forgotten. Are in fact in ours. We all are bears. Main goal is not to hurt you, but we all are bears. And that could be an issue, cause we're not known for being friendly. Not known for being kind. Known for making lunches out those we meet outside. We all are bears, each and every one around you. We all are bears, and we won't care when they found you. Just a pile of sun dry bones lying in the grass. But come on. Hey, I think Metallica is in town because this terrain is rocky. I hate you. Shut up. <laughs>